Oreo, you go to. Hey, I almost got Oreos. This is fun. I really like this deck. I don't know if it's in any way, shape, or form efficient, but. Now, like, I don't have to worry about what this card is. I just get to destroy it. Peace out. Oh, I just killed him off that, too. Ha! <laughs> If that was intentional, that would have been awesome, but that didn't even enter my mind. But still, like, that was... That's the kind of shit that's, like, it's really fun. Or they would pull out some of their own bullshit that's even stronger. Never mind, that's not stronger. Unless, of course, he has the fucking unicorn's horn, in which case I am going to throw a goddamn fit. Don't you dare put out a unicorn's horn. I swear to God, if you drop a unicorn's mother fucker. Just when, you, just when you think, oh, hey, look at me. I'm hot shit. Look at this hand that I got. He pulls out that bullshit. And now I got nothing. I got nothing. I got... This is my Hail Mary right here. Oh, good, I can get rid of one of these. I, oh my god, did my Hail Mary just work? Did my Hail Mary just work? He's gonna have some... Oops, my bad. He's gonna have some bullshit. That face down card is going to be some bullshit. I promise you. That is going to prevent me... Fucking knew it. Fucking knew it. Fuck this game. But yeah, this deck, like, I would love to see. Oh, dear God. Wait. 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 But you have no idea how fucking infuriating those button prompts are. So I'm just gonna get rid of it. Oh, dear God. What? Wait, wait, wait! Oh, while it's in the graveyard! Oh, shit, I killed myself! Oh, no! Oh, my God. This may have just saved my life. That may have just saved my life. <laughs> yeah. There's no way it's gonna let me attack on this turn. Holy crap, it doesn't say that I can't attack. Oh, never mind, that's the wrong description. saying that like it's not saying that I can't attack as far as I can tell holy crap <laughs> that's fair foolish check this out watch this it's gonna be stupid I am going to be stupid son of a bitch fuck box right here by the way can we talk about how fucking stupid it is that they made the attack values black with white border I cannot read those from a certain distance away like I'm sitting closer than I normally would right now solely because I cannot actually read those attack and defense values uh, from like as far away as I can read of everything else. That doesn't seem useful.
anytime he gets in. dead here if I think if he hadn't sacrificed them like if he had just if he had just attacked with all of the dudes I would be dead instead of but now instead I get to live for one more turn oh shit that's actually a very real problem oh, never mind. god damn So we're going to activate that so I have that sitting there. Oh, I can add it from the graveyard too. So that, so that effectively doubles my amount of elegant egotists that I have. And now I can change this dude to attack position. This guy has 2650 health. Why am I going through all this planning? This guy is dead. can set this up with a sacrifice I am actually going to let me stop checking the field so oh never mind this dude's dead I'm sorry I forgot that I was checking the field and it wasn't even my turn I'm fucked of course we survived we have 800 health there's always the possibility to run this back I have the cards needed I got the cards that I needed to run this back Might be able to summon another thing, but that's fine. We'll live with that. We'll deal with that. I think I can. St I think believe I still win. I'm not paying attention to the math, but I definitely have enough because I still have a 2200 damage attack coming through. We pulled that out of our ass. Shout out to the Harpy deck. Sky. Can we talk about? Can we go look at these? How fucking anime. Can you really get, like, have you ever seen anything more anime than all of this? Than whatever this is? So anime. This. It gains attack equal to its original depth, so he's walking around 2k. And if it's a defense position, what does it do? It gains depth equal to its original attack. So it basically just swaps the stats allows you oh it gains oh shit okay um yeah sure i don't think i'm gonna need this card against this guy oh it has to be a spell card no never mind i don't want to i gotta hold that all right cool i gotta hold that i did not read the fine print Really, the Dark Magician. This homie gonna bring in the Dark Magician. So he's gonna summon the next turn. His game plan is to summon the Dark Magician, add that card to it, to it, and I am going to steal the hell out of it. And he's gonna be so mad. He's gonna have to tribute both of these dudes to get the Dark Magician. Then he's gonna use the Horn of the Unicorn on it to kill this card. And I am going to steal it with the Vampire Vamp. And I am guaranteeing a Rage Quit. I want a Rage Quit. Do I know people, or do I know people? Horn of the Unicorn. And now, guess what's gonna happen after this? When I steal his card, that Horn of the Unicorn is getting put back on the top of his 40 card, still 40 card deck, 
and he is going to have to hold the salt because that is two free turns on my part where I get free reign he's dead actually you know what I'm not even gonna give him a chance this motherfucker's dead I'm not gonna do that I don't want to actually do that that would be a terrible idea all right so first things first we're gonna activate this card he has no idea what's about to hit him people he is about to get destroyed thank you for your dark magician nobody uses that card but now I am going to use it more effectively than anybody has ever done before because you are going to hold the entirety of this 4,500 damage. Is he going to go the way of the samurai? He's going to kill himself? Kudos. I can appreciate that. 